Hello everyone, I'm the Dino Gamer. This is part 4 of Carnival Dinos vs. Everything in the Game. So, last episode we did the Carnival Dinos vs. the Aquatics and the Fantasy Animals. Today we're doing the Carnival Dinos vs. the first 4 reptiles in the game. So, let's start by getting green anacondas. We place enough to match the exact price of the carnivores theme. So approximately five hundred dollars. We leave this is close enough. Thirty three green anacondas. Let's turn on pathfinding and turn it on and let's begin. I had to turn up the music of the game because unfortunately it was copyrighted. But we can still hear the dinosaur sounds. You see the dinosaur here munching the anaconda sort of like spaghetti in a way. Hi Lufus Rush, this is still alive man. Normally this dinosaur always dies first. Looks like Velociraptor is dead. But that's to be expected as well as Dinonychus. Is Krylophosaurus dead? I yes. Krylophosaurus finally died. Ooh, Spinosaurus just flung Grinas Grinaconda Anaconda so far away. Looks like only a few more remain and Almost all the carnival dinosaurs survived, even Kylophosaurus, surprisingly. That was a really easy battle for the carnival team. Next, let's go against Pteranodons. Oops. Team 2, and let's begin placing them. So 31 Tranodons with the entire carnival team. Let's begin. They make a really interesting sound, but they sort of attack in really weird groups from all angles as well. Pretty interesting tactic. You see them basically swarming the T-Rex. Carnotaurus is dead. As well as Crylophosaurus. Allosaurus just died. Only our two big heavy hitters left. But fortunately that isn't enough to kill the carnivore team. And T-Rex and Spinosaurus have almost full health left. They did nearly no damage. Next, let's go against saltwater crocodiles. Again, I placed this on the wrong thing by mistake. Twenty-three saltwater crocodiles with the carnivore team. I believe the carnivores will win again. Especially since the sword was a crock and a fight the Tyrannodons did. Each crock is almost as long as the Trilophosaurus. But Trilophosaurus is still standing strong. They're basically biting the angles of the T-Rex and Spinosaurus. Calophosaurus is still alive, as well as our main dinosaur. Who looks like Calophosaurus just died, unfortunately. But the carnivore dinos won again. 
with most of the health remaining, especially T Rex and Spinosaurus. Now it's time for our last battle of the day Komodo Dragon. 20 Komodo Dragons with the Carnival Dino team. This doesn't look too good for the Komodo Dragons. Looks like the Carnival Dinos will win every single battle of the Reptile faction. Alistair just threw this Komodo Dragon in the air and it died instantly. However, Alistair did die subsequently. But, looks like almost as soon as the battle started, it's over. That's pretty interesting. Looks like the Komodo Dragons have a bit of a poison effect. Which is really weird, but cool at the same time. What's your T-Rex? You can see some scars. In a way. Alasaurus is all bumpy. Pretty interesting. Anyway, thank you for watching this video. Please consider subscribing and let me know what you'd like to see down below in the comments. Bye for now.